I'm sure the first time you saw a crossbill, you thought, what's wrong with that bird's beak? But when you find out that the entire genus of six species all has this messed up beak, this doesn't seem like a random deformity. So why do crossbills have crossed bills? Well, it's an adaptation to eat the seeds of conifer trees. Conifers reproduce using cones. Male cones will produce pollen that's blown around by the wind. It lands on a female cone that fertilizes the ovule to form a seed. The female cone then seals up, allowing the seed to develop, only to be released once fully mature, allowing these seeds to be dispersed by wind or animals. Crossbills are a little cheeky though, because their bills are adapted to open up the female cones and extract the seeds. They do this by inserting their beaks between the cone's scales and twisting their lower mandible, prying open the cone and allowing them to get the seed at the bottom with their tongue. Young crossbills actually have straight bills. The wedged and crossness, is, is that a word? Actually develops as they grow and start practicing opening up cones. Crossbills also have handedness, where the bee can either protrude left or right. And just like with people, we aren't really sure on the mechanisms that cause this. Different crossbill species also specialize to specific conifers found within their range but they can eat from other conifers if their preferred species has crop failure, they just won't be as efficient. 